finished the last training session today, Friday. You've done shape already for Saturday in Cheltenham. Yeah, boys ready to go. Um, yeah, not, not many people in the injury room, which is good. We've had a few of us, including myself, who've had a few muscular ones. Unfortunately, Daz has got one in his hamstring again, so he's still in there. But apart from Daz, I think we're all out there. And um, obviously, if selected, everyone's ready to go. The, looking back on the game at, at Forest Green when Cheltenham came, you obviously scored that outstanding header, had a great game in the centre midfield. Yeah. It's going to be another tough test, isn't it? Yeah, of course. I think that game's the only the only game I've started centre midfield and I really enjoyed it in there. And hopefully I can get back in there sooner rather than later. But it's going to be one of those occasions like it was on that night where there's, there's a big crowd, there's a, there's a lot on it. Obviously it's a local derby, everyone wants to win. Bragging rights for the people outside when they go to work and things like that. So there's a lot on the game and added pressure because we're first and second. So we're all ready for it, but they're the type of games you've got to look forward to rather than fear. It's been quite interesting the build up to it as well, really. I, I mean, I think Forest Green watching from the outside, it's to, to the players and maybe the manager, it's, it's almost just another game. Whereas Cheltenham, I've got the feeling that it's almost like a cup final for them. Um, I don't really know because I'm not in the media side of it and whatever. I stay away from social media and stuff like that. It doesn't really affect me in any way, but if you're saying that, then that may be the case. But for me, without sounding like cliche, then it is another game. It is just another game at the end of the day. If we lose to these and then we go and win, then that's three points either way and vice versa. But obviously we're going into this game going strong. We're, we're ready. We were ready at the home game. I thought we were the better team. That's not being disrespectful to them. He kept them in the changing room 15 to 20 minutes after that game, so he clearly wasn't happy. So hopefully we can um, go out there and give the same performance, but this time come where we're three rather than one. And again, of course, it's uh, one of your former clubs. Yeah, of course. Um, I had a little bit in the programme in the last game. I uh, spoke well of them and just spoke from my heart, really, as I always do. Um, that will never change. It was a very difficult time for me off the pitch, and that football club helped me because they let me put my boots on and go out and play while it was a difficult time. So that will never be forgotten. Um, I, I always show my respect. Looking at both squads, what, what really comes to mind when I look at the Forest Green squad is that huge amount of strength that you've got on the bench. With, I mean, you were on the bench last week. Aaron O'Connor came back as well. There's, there's a tremendous amount of talent on that bench. Yeah, I think due to the fact that like the people that you've just mentioned, including myself, have been injured, now we're all back and all of a sudden this is our full squad, then then obviously we're strong. And that, that's what we're all about. We, we know whoever slots in, whoever plays, whoever's called upon, whoever comes off the bench, we can all make an impact and that keeps other teams on their toes. Yeah. We know the league's not won tomorrow, uh, depending on the result, if you win or Cheltenham win. It is still such a long way to go. Yeah, of course it is. It's, it's come where we've played each other quite close. We, obviously the games haven't been spread out. They're both done before Christmas. So they are big games and we are, in, in my mind, um, two of the best teams in the league. But like you said, the, the league's going to be won after Christmas, not now. But if you can go in with that extra three points then rather than the zero points, then obviously that gives you a little bit of a push. Okay, cheers, David. Nice Thanks.